Welcome back web enthusiasts. I am Ayaz Zafar. Today we are unlocking the secrets of font integration in web design specifically for Angular 17. We will explore how to enhance your projects with custom fonts both locally and using Google Fonts. Fonts set the tone of your website. They are not just text, they are an essential part of your design. So join us as we guide you through the process of selecting and implementing fonts in Angular 17. In this tutorial, we will cover two methods to integrate fonts in Angular 17. First, using a locally downloaded font and leveraging Google Fonts. Get ready to elevate your app's design. First, let's select a font. For that, we have to explore sites like Google Fonts for a vast selection. Once you find your font, you can either download it or use it directly from the Google Font. We will explore both methods. Let's do it all together. Open the Google Font. This is the font that you can see that is a default font that we have in Angular. So in the Google Font, you can scroll down and find any interesting font that you want to use and here click on the download family. Open the font wherever it has been downloaded extract it and you can take it so right now it is regular font if you include multiple font families you can select them as well right now there is only one font weight that is 400 that's why there is only one file so anyways now we have that font file i can simply drag and drop it in my angular assets folder so let's do that move it there and now after downloading the font update the style css file like this open it i will add a font face and we will have font family and the source of the font so here i will add my font name it can be any name whatever you prefer but the url has to be correct so here you can add assets slash the font that you want to select and after that add a space here and provide format true type as it is ttf that's mean it is a true type format okay if you have multiple font files you can simply add comma here and add multiple files like this right now we have only one file so i will just keep it simple like this so now let's test it uh, before testing we have to add this font right now we are using roboto i will replace it with this one and see if that is applied or not go back here refresh it uh, make sure to add it in double quotes here we also need to add font weight normal and font style normal so there is a problem that this font is not available so i prefer to add a fonts folder here here and move your fonts in that folder and then open the angular.json file and find the assets folder and specify the font folder that you just added in your assets folder okay now restart the server stop it and start again there are some errors that we have to address so as we changed the path of this font so that's why uh, it is not able to find it so let's add here font slash this okay all right you can see that font has been applied Next, we will use Google Fonts live URLs to add the fonts instead of adding them locally by downloading. Uh, Google Fonts, we don't need to download. We can just include the font link in your index.html file or in the CSS file and it will start working. So for that, go back to your fonts website and here I will find some other interesting font. So let's say I want to use this one. So here on this page, you will select which one you want. I will remove the uh, other font that i added earlier so select this and here either copy this and go back to the index.html and paste it here so this is one method so if you do that you can simply use it so to use it this is the font family name that you have to use it so for that instead of this one add this one and now you will check that new font has been added and the second approach is that you can just get rid of this from here and go back to the angular uh, google fonts website and use the css syntax to import it in this way now go back to your global styles file and remove this one and instead i will add it okay you will see that it is still working even after removing it from here so remember different browsers may render fonts differently for local fonts use formats like woff2 or uh, for better compatibility for google fonts their hosting takes care of the compatibility and optimization for you 
and that's how you add custom font to your angular 17 projects both locally and via google fonts experiment with different styles to find the perfect match for your application if this tutorial was helpful then please like share and subscribe for more angular insights happy coding and see you in the next one explore more tutorials on our channel and if you have any questions then drop them in the comments below stay tuned for more angular magic